What is going on guys? In today's video, I'm going to go over exactly how you can make money overnight without risking any money. With that being said, let's jump into the computer. I've been getting dirty money, Jordan Belford. Stacking penny stocks while I'm flipping these birds. Sipping on Ciroc, trip them up with the words. I just popped the molly and I think it's be my third. What is going on guys? So you guys all want to know how to trade or how to trade overnight without really enduring much risk. And as you can see, I got a picture of a long strangle up on, and this is really kind of how I'm going to explain this. Now, I've got another picture up that I'm gonna explain the other way. Um, but with that being said, I wanna explain this first. So a strangle um, is really basically, you're going to end up buying two options. Now you're thinking, why is he talking about options? He trades stocks. Now that is true, but I've gotten into options a lot more as well. Um, especially with overnight plays, this one is really going to allow you, let me, first of all, before you guys are all hating, this is real time data. Um, let's just, these really don't matter right now. I just want to really show you guys this part. So this um, right here is really where you're going to see the unlimited profit. So what you're going to do is you're going to buy a call and you're going to buy a put here. So basically say you're going to go in overnight. Um, let's just go back a little bit. You bought a you bought a call at this and a put at the exact same strike price. Now I know that's not a strangle. That's a straddle. So let's talk about the straddle. They are different. So the straddle, you're going to buy them both the same strike price. And basically, the way I do it, so you get an extra trade off of it on a small account, is what you're going to do is, because here, you're not losing money. Even though the stock has opened up at a different price range than before, as you can see here, we are above it but you're really not losing any money on your put option here. Now you guys can see I got a trend line here from the past day or so, and this was a resistance point for me. Um, so I wanted to see it break through it, and it did it on pre-market. So we're really just gonna focus in on this portion of the chart. So you're going to buy your straddle. Yeah, the straddle one, sorry guys. I just wanna make sure I got the terminology correct on here for you, everybody. Um, so the straddle, you buy the straddle here on Thursday night. <coughs> this is Friday's market. So you bought the straddle here. Say you bought a, we're going to go with a two, mm, let's go with a 290.50. Put in a call. Strike price on the same exact date. That way you're basically breaking even through all of this, you're able to hold it all. Now, sometimes you will have it where one is up higher than the other and you're making a little bit of money off of this. Yeah, my cat's over here, so sorry about that. But what you're gonna be able to do for those of you with a small account is basically when you get up to here is cut, if you think it's gonna keep running through the day, is you can cut the put option because you're gonna break even because one went up, one went down. Um, in value. So you're going to cut the put option and let this thing run or take profit up in here, whatever you want to do, let it run a little bit and take profit. And then you made money basically overnight when you take profit on your call. And then you can always re enter for your actual day trade. So you're basically making an overnight trade um, play with no risk and you're being able to still execute the trade and know which you, you're going to be able to make money whether the stock went up or down. Now, when it comes down to this, guys, I want you guys to be making sure you're not trading penny stocks when it comes down to this. And I'm showing you SPY for a very, very special reason here. Um, now, I'm showing you this because when it comes down to options, guys, you want to be able to sell your option. You don't want to be stuck in it and have to execute it because when you're when you're doing it very very short term with options, your goal is to literally buy the contracts, wait for the value of the contracts to go up, 
and sell the contracts. We're not trying to execute the contracts. And that may be a little bit of terminology that some of the new traders don't get. But just trust me on this. I always buy at least a week out in options. Now, I could be wrong on certain situations, of course. So, like, if it's a Friday, um, I'm going to do it, like, the next Wednesday or Friday. And again, options are Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays. Um, you won't see Tuesdays and Thursdays. Um, but you're not buying, for instance, over here on today's watch list was an XELA. You're not buying those kind of stocks options for these. You're buying a SPY. Um, you may be able to buy Roku. I got students that trade Roku options. But you're trading options that you can that are very, very liquid. And that's why I tried SPY when it comes down to options because I don't want to be stuck in them whatsoever. Because there are stocks that, ha that are lower priced, like these over here, ACB, A, B, Y, A that have options, but yet you basically have to execute them when you get into them um, because nobody else wants to buy these options. And that becomes a very, very problem or a very, very big problem when you're trying to basically day trade these stocks or just an overnight hold on these stocks. With that being said, guys, I just want to keep this video super short, super sweet and to the point on basically how you can do an overnight play, make money and have absolutely zero risk involved. With that being said, guys, thank you all for watching the video. Don't forget to smash that like, thumbs up button, and I hope to see you guys in the next video.